Yes, sir, baby. Hope you're doing well. Today is Thursday, March 2nd, 2023. Welcome back to another daily upload. Today, we have the Combine promo that has officially dropped. Mr. Leon Sandcastle making his return to Madden. We also have two LTDs, Mario Williams and CJ2K, bunch of 97s. We do get a new reroll, new reduxes, a bunch of stuff happening in Madden today, baby. I hope you're excited. If you like the video, make sure you like the video. Comment down below what play you get is a must cop for you in the Combine promo. Don't forget to sub, man. It's free for you. doesn't cost you a thing. Here's our love. Goal is 10,000 by April 5th and 20,000 subs by the end of the year. Years. If you haven't hit that sub button already, I definitely appreciate it. 60% of you guys that watch the videos are not sub. Help your boy's dream come true and get to 10,000 subs by April 5th. And of course, to the 97 overall giveaway, congratulations to Philby0446. We're winning this giveaway for Kyle Pitts. If you see this, make sure that you do hit me up on Twitter so I can get a way to uh, get this Kyle Pitts to you in the next 24, 48 hours. If I don't hear back from this person, I will go ahead and respond to it, man. But make sure you're on the lookout, baby, because tonight I will be live on stream, probably about 9 p.m. Eastern. I may have another Kyle Pitts to give away live on stream, so you don't want to miss it. Let's jump into it, baby. As you can see, CJ2K Mario Williams are the two LTEs right now. We have a couple offers. We have a 50% off in store now Redux offer. Might as well jump at this right away. Contains 295 overall Redux players, 295 plus, I should say, 193 overall Redux player, and 191 overall elite player, and an 89 overall elite player. Good thing about this is there is 96 Redux players that are in the game as well. We did lose training variety packs. I was wrong. Okay, I can admit that I was wrong. I thought they were going to reset, but maybe they'll come back this weekend. Maybe it's going to take a week away from them, though. But if you need to get training today, a good place to look that I've been finding finding it right now is 95 Redux players, right? Because it's a guaranteed 295. I was finding those 94 five Reduxes for about 140,000, 150,000. So getting it for almost two per is very, very good if you are trying to do this new 90 overall combine reroll. So let's take a look at some of these combine players. Now I have done some of these rolls offline. I kind of liked them. They weren't too bad. I pulled a, a good amount of 90s on the combine reroll, but I did pull a 95, which those 95s are kind of rare. They do have value. They go for like 250 right now, even 260. The 93s are, have a little bit of value and so do the 90s. So it's not terrible for a reroll. I'll probably do a million on here too. So we can kind of take a look at it. Uh, maybe we'll do some packs on top of that because we do have 96 reduxes or I might save that for another video. But let's take a look. Tristan Riffs, 97 overall right tackle, 94 strength, 92 awareness, 90 seven pass block with a 96 run block so that's not really a terrible card again the 97s can be pulled out of the 90 plus reroll as well but uh, what i've been seeing is they are very rare for them to get pulled out leon sandcastle man awesome card art 98 speed 96 excel 80 tackle 97 play rec 90 pursuit 97 man 99 zone and 84 power but what i have seen too is you can actually use the 96 dion corner card as well as a free safety on the same defense so when dion sanders does get an upgraded card it's going to be nasty you're going to have leon sandcastle free safety are probably going to go ahead and have the 99 Dion whenever he gets an ultimate legend card and I can see Leon Sandcastle actually getting a golden ticket this year too because his card would be very very good Julio who doesn't love Julio Jones cards man we love Julio 97 speed 97 jump 95 catch 97 catch and traffic 97 spec 94 short 96 medium and 97 deep route running Falcons Bucks where else did he go? Titans, right? How many theme teams has he been on now? We all know him from the Falcons, man. One of the greatest wide receivers ever graced the field of football. 6'3 as well. Insane stats. He is a playmaker archetype too. He's going to be an absolute menace to society out in that gridiron, baby. Bruce Irvin, 700,000 coins. He had a great combine, man. He always gets one of these with the high overall combine cards. 95 speed, 96 excel, 96 three strength, 91 tackle, 90 play rec, 98 block, 97 power, and 82 finesse move. Solid card. Uh, next up, one of the first of two LTDs, Mario Williams going for a a good amount right now again if you do pull them i highly recommend that you go ahead and sell this card because he is very expensive we don't know if training variety packs are coming back this weekend like they did last time or if they're going to be gone for a week but we still have the 90 combine reroll, and it's still relatively early in the day later tonight for, for the most part this card should probably be like 700 800k more and more people are going to be ripping it but 94 speed 89 excel 98 strength 90 tackle 92 player 98 block shed 98 power move and 95 finesse move his 94 uh ltd card was very good too he had a legend card it was a redux as well that card was insane. It was one of the best left ends in the game. Um, is he better than JJ Watt? I mean, that's completely up to you. I still think this is a very, very good card as well. He is 6'6", so that's an absolute menace. Finally, man, the most expensive one, Mr. CJ2K. 1.7 million coins. If you could pull this card, you're in for some big business. 98 speed, 99 excel, 97 agility, 89 carry, 88 catch, 97 change of direction, and 95 break tackle, man. Prime Chris Johnson, unbelievable. Uh, especially in, I think, 2009. He had his 09 year, 2,000 rushing yards. Broke the record for the most scrimmage yards. That was a crazy year. If you remember CJ2K, man, back in the day, 
He was so good, but he should get Titans and Jets theme team. Jets just got even better of a theme team. I always like the combine promo, man. It's always been a good time. Uh, 96 Reduxes are alive and well. Obviously, you can pull a lot of these uh, when you get the the Redux offer. If you decide to get it, I'm not going to get it. I'll probably just wait for Train Variety Pack. But you can get Cy Hill in. Uh, Damian Lewis got out of here. Aaron Donald. Some other big names too. It's going to be King Henry. His 96 got dropped in here. Chris McAllister actually gets his card too for people that wanted him. AJ Brown, Owen Daniels, a uh, Derek Brooks, and it looks like King Henry is not on here at all. I saw one earlier going for like 800k and he did get bought, but I'm pretty sure it's about 2596 overall reduxes. So we will update the list for redux hunters, baby. All right, so we got 760,000 training. So we got to, we're going to do a bunch of these combine rerolls. Uh, I've heard online that a lot of people are not liking these rerolls. Apparently, they're very, very bad, which is not surprising because every single reroll has been awful. Um, I got my training for relatively cheap. I'm getting it for like 2 1 right now, CPT. And I'm curious to try some of these other rerolls. I felt like rerolls maybe aren't terrible. They probably are. But what plays a big part into it is probably how much you're getting it for. So I'm going to be live on stream. I'm going to do some AKA rerolls. I might do some GG rerolls rolls tonight too uh, online so make sure you're there it's going to be a good time combine wise 108,000 coins contains 181 overall and 290 plus combine players so three cards for 108 right now 90s are going for about 35 34,000 so right here making bare minimum back you're probably getting about 65,000 so you're already losing 40k um just pulling 90s if you pull 93s you're gonna have to pull at least 193 in here uh for it to actually make profit 93s are starting to drop down too i think 93s are getting close to the 80 k mark make sure you look under like 94 95 reduxes man that kind of helps out a lot animations fire too not a bad one it kind of looks like a little bit like you know how the car looks a little bit it needs to be sharpened a little bit i should say hey, holy frick 95 to brill peppers these are expensive right 250 000 for this wow solid solid pull so i'm just gonna take the i'm gonna keep all this i'll take the training for the 86 and i'll do one more and i'll do some more pro game days i don't i'm not gonna plan on ripping all these because i want to save these for another video i think i'm gonna drop it tomorrow because then I have a bunch to do on two accounts. We're going to get 93 Kalen Barnes. Man, are these actually pretty decent? Be which I don't know if it's true. Quick, come on now. 87 Bo Jackson. Uh, this one as well should be a little bit of profit. Maybe about 80K right here. Plus 30 is 120. Another 87. I think I'm going to keep going because I'm two for two on profit. Very rare to pull anything 95 plus because 97s are still very expensive. Uh, 90 here and another 90. I think we'll call it there. We made two profits right there. So I'm going to take my profit and happily walk away. 19,000. We're going to run through these. We have a little bit less than a mil so i mean we could probably do about 35 to 40 times obviously in order to make profit right a 90 is going to quick sell for 10,000. you need to make a 93 plus in this pack is a 90 93 95 and 97 plus two ltds so as long as you get a 93 plus you're going to hit pretty good. You're going to you're going to make profit. Now, the odds of that happening, very slim. What's kind of nice about this, though, is if you miraculously pull a 95, that's going to help you out a lot because those are super expensive, at least 250,000 coins. And since I got this training for almost like two to two, one, got a very cheap, I only need like a hit one or two decent pulls, like maybe a couple 95s or 197, probably going to make profit on it. I want to say I probably only spent like 1.6 million coins on it, so I don't really need a lot to make back. Each 90 is guaranteeing me right now about 30,000 back. So the Bare minimum, I'll walk away if I pull like 35 to 40 times. Bare minimum is 1.2 million coins. So uh, if I pull nothing but 90s this whole pack opening, I'm losing 400k. If I miraculously squeeze out a 95 and maybe a couple 93s, it's really not a bad roll. It just depends on how, you know, how crappy they are. And again, 90s are going to be very cheap at some point. They're going to drop below 25,000, I would assume. I love training rerolls, man. I just wish they were better as we are going to get a 93. So we'll take that. I wish they were just a little bit better for pull rates, even just up them a little bit, right? It doesn't have to be crazy. But getting your training uh, cheap is, I feel like, the biggest key to actually trying to make profit in these things. Because then it only truly takes one big pull to make profit or make some coins man darnell savage which that card's actually very very good user uh over under 195 plus i'm gonna give that I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that that's how that's how rare that is to pull in these i'm gonna go over i think we'll get a 95 at least one if i get 195 i'm gonna be i'll be sitting pretty with that as we get another 90 i really do want to try other re-rolls i feel like it could be very interesting because the market's cheaper especially aka re-rolls i don't like them that much i feel like if it's a little bit of a less uh less training it might pay off a little bit better if you do follow me on twitter then you know i did open one um aka pack this morning just to kind of get rid of the rest of the training before tvps went away and i pulled a 
97 PS2. So I was so surprised and I sold them for half a million coins. The easiest half a million I ever made. And people always say that AK packs and AK rerolls are way better other than Monday. So maybe we'll do that tonight on stream as we're gonna get another 93. We'll take that. Let me know in the comments below uh, as well how you guys like these rerolls. If you like them, if you've had any luck, if you pulled an LTD. Uh, since Mario Williams, CJ2K are well over a million coins. That lets you know as well how good these rolls are. They're very, very rare to pull. Uh, JJ Watt, again, probably went up in price uh, because the TBPs went away. I didn't buy any JJ Watts because I did. I truly thought that the TBPs were just going to reset because, you know, logically it made sense. But uh, but if, if you did, man, you missed out. You could probably, I mean, JJ Watt's going to be impossible to do as we're going to uh, get Donovan People Jones. 593 so far, the rest 90s. So, I mean, we're probably made back at least a couple, like six, 700,000 so far. I'm on pace to lose. Obviously, the only way I'm going to make profit is if I pull like at least one or 295. I am up uh, on this pack opening so far. I was up a little bit on the uh, the three packs we did because we pulled the 95. So I'm going to make sure I sell that, especially for 250. That's very expensive for the 250. Uh, maybe I might make a, a set, a 97 set. We'll see what's more beneficial. Usually when uh, when you have packs, it's more beneficial just to sell the card individually. Dude, you guys got to at least give me 195 plus. There we go. DPJ. I tried to abbreviate it. It didn't work out. A 93 People's Jones will take that. Another probably 75,000, maybe 80K. I might be able to squeeze out of it depending on what they're coming down. 93s are falling pretty quick. Same with 90. Not a single 95, almost a million trading. Not a single 95 plus. Yeah, I mean, the pull rates are very terrible and that's just normal. That's how they've been forever. These could, I mean, depending on how it ends, man, this could be one of the worst rerolls we've had because the pull rates are so hard for 95 pluses. We're gonna get 890 Darnell Savage. 20,000, man, this is what a TVP is gonna be looking like when they come back. We're gonna be flying through like million openings in five minutes, man. So crazy that we allowed it to get this high. Another 90. Um, another 90 overall. Wonderful. We can do about five more times already. Should we bring our hot hands for five packs? Um, I'm probably gonna, I'll be live on stream later tonight. Like I said, I don't think I'm gonna do a lot of combine rerolls on there, but I will do other trading rerolls because I feel like it could be very interesting, especially with the AKA rerolls right now. So we're gonna have to try those out. Even with the Super Bowl rerolls, because the little method that happened yesterday is we're gonna get down to people's Jones. I have a video on it. I don't know if I wanna drop it. It's a very good coin making method, but I don't think it's liable right now. Um, I, last night it was, I have to check the prices of the team infinities. If it still is, and I think you can make coins, then I will drop it for you guys either today or tomorrow. I'll have a double upload at some point within the next couple of days. 90 overall, we can do it one more time and we're going to take a look and see what we ended with. We'll go quick sell and see what training we ended with. This one's going to be what? Walk off. 90 Darnell Savage, man. Let's look at the minor. All right. So we started right here. We ended with what? 535,000. So I lost what? 250,000 training almost. God, my God. Uh, I'm definitely gonna have to sell these back individually. We did pull that 195 to build pepper. So I am going to go ahead and quick sell that or uh, sell that. I should say 245. I'll sell for 244. Very expensive for a, uh, for a 95 right now, especially I'm getting 95s for like 150. And since the pack opening was so bad, I'm going to go ahead and just sell all these individually. I personally would avoid the combine rerolls. I don't think they're that good. I'd work on maybe trying to get training stacked up. You can buy cheaper players if there's certain reduxes you want. This is the time to do it, man. If you like the video, make sure you like the video. Make sure you're there. Our live on stream, 8 p.m. Eastern, man. It's going to be a good time. Stay up and see you guys. Tell your mom and tell your daddy. Catch you guys on the next video.